Hey, Libby Gang Gang. Good morning. Good morning. How y'all doing? How y'all doing? It's your girl Ruth. Welcome back. Welcome back. Trying to get through with this weekend readings already here, but whatever. Okay. Alrighty. Let's see what's happening for you. Hope y'all doing great. Having a wonderful weekend. Downloads take so long. The last one, the Virgo, was 15 hours again. <laughs> Hopefully, this one won't. Let's see. Okay. Okay, okay we got important letter reverse okay let's see put everything down first okay. queen of pentacles sage business professional uh, passion about new beginnings birth congratulations you're having a baby okay and the towel reverse so let's see. Uh, Five of Pentacles, First Deacon, Taurus, Mercury. Delays around money coming in from the cold. Then we have Judgment. So that's either Judgment on your money. Are you coming out in the cold? Healing it, rising up, leveling up. And then we have Knight of Wands. So it's like somebody was coming in to the same old BS and uh, Scorpio Sag change, but it got halted. Yeah, somebody was coming in trying to sing the same old song to you, explain the situation. Either they decided not to do it because they couldn't fool you, or you didn't answer the phone or you didn't answer that text call or whatever it was you're like okay you left me out in the cold um i'm leveling up now you know i i, I get your tactics you know i've been here before um i got to focus on what i'm doing on my healing healing others, my path that I'm on. Let's see, queen of my business, queen of pentacles, Sag and Capricorn, I gotta stay focused, gotta keep myself, my mind intact. I'm passionate about what I'm doing in my career. Or maybe they just wanna come in and have sex and you running down the rules to them you're not loyal, you're not, you know, you don't consider what you're doing. Uh, you're avoiding the tower, or they're avoiding the tower, catastrophe. Yeah, you're avoiding any kind of heartbreak. It's like you're saying, you, I can't let you juggle me. You know, two of pentacles, money, confusion, juggling, two situations, ideals. You got too many things going on, you're trying to do for yourself. You're trying to level up, and they coming in only one passion, which you probably been cool with that, okay? But it's a way that you do it. You know what I'm saying? If we're gonna be on this level of sexual, let's keep it sexual. Don't come over here and say that you want a relationship when you actually juggling or don't know what you want, and you confuse me. So. You avoiding all that heartbreak. Okay, yeah. Happy home, four wands, possible country setting. So you happy. You was doing good. You was doing fine. Then here comes somebody want to play with your feelings and want to juggle you. Or you could be doing this to somebody. That's what I'm saying. So you trying to figure out the best way to go about your money, 
your career, you planning for the future, you see yourself on where you want to be, how you want to be. If you don't, you need to. In the higher front, reverse. You know, you wouldn't worry about marriage, you wouldn't worry about maybe getting divorced. Um, you know, and this is a person that come in that's not faithful. Probably don't even know what they want. And you kind of focus, know what you want, you know. Yeah, shooting your arrows of love. They don't know what love means. And you probably uh, know what it means, but you know what it look like, at least when it's coming to you. And how you want to be treated with respect. You know, people got to understand if it's sexual, let's keep it sexual. Let's protect ourselves, you know, let's make sure everything is going, you know, enjoying each other for that moment. No strings attached. But the moment you try to say strings attached and then you're not persistent and you don't do what you say you're supposed to be doing, then that confuses, especially a Libra. It's like, okay, so you trying to hold me back from being with somebody else. And we got the lovers, yeah, because you want to mess around. You want to do all, you want to do what you want to do, but you don't want the leaper to do that. You want to, like, keep them as a prize, so to speak, on the side while you go in Gemini, while you go and do what you want to do. And they supposed to just wait on you to come. When it's about controlling you, that's really what's going on. You come when you want to come. Uh, sweet situation of finish. It's not over with. So you want to come in and out when you want to. But you still want to go over here and mess with other people. And if it's fine if, if both parties can do the same thing. Okay. We got page of cups. We got somebody want to make you pregnant. Congratulations if you are. Basically good news. You know, probably coming a bouquet of flowers, candy, or something they want to give you. It's Valentine's Day or something like that. Play with the kids if y'all got kids together. You know what I'm saying? For that moment. But it's probably a community dick. Or oh, pussy, whatever one. You know what I'm saying? And they get around. Overseas trip, money, luck, world in the palm of your hand, new opportunities. Like I say, be open. People don't, a lot of people don't know how to be open and honest with how they truly feel because they greedy. They want to have their cake, like they say, and eat it too. And they don't want you to be the same way. That's messing with their manhood or their woman. If a woman's doing that, that's her manhood as well, masculine energy. So that's not fair. And here we got, yeah, I want to stop what you're doing so you can focus on what they're doing, but they don't want, they want you to depend on them. If they don't even know how to lead, how do you supposed to depend on someone who don't know how to lead? They want to stop you, whatever you're doing. You know, that's not fair. You know, they want to be underhanded, sneaky, you know. You're dealing with somebody who don't know how to be fixed, that don't know how to how relationships go. They're so used to doing this, having their own way. But they want you sitting to the side. And the minute you tell them, no, that's not the way I'm going to be treated by anyone, they have a problem with that. They want you to stay blinded. They don't want you to see what they're doing. I see you. Do you see me? <clears throat> no, I don't want you to see me. But I see you. So they put you in this box of how they want you to be. But they forgot you had a life too. So you know the game. Okay? You play a player too. You know what I'm saying? But they don't like that. That's messing with their manhood. But they're not offering you something that's tangible. You can hold on to. You can depend on. Most people don't know how. 
Not everybody. Don't know how to be faithful and true. Let's put our cards on the table. You know, and this this the type of person who um, don't understand how the roles of a male and a female go. Okay. So they want to be one way and you kind of, you be the shadow. Only want you when they want you to appear for their benefit to make them look good. This is what it's looking like. Yeah, a hollow victory. Okay. Yeah. Death situation of Scorpio. A beings, new beginnings. Okay. They want to stop whatever it is. My condolences if y'all uh, lost anyone. But yeah, they want to stop what you're doing. Now you focus on them. So when they get ready to come in your world and do whatever they want to do, you know, you still be blinded, stupid, you know, uh, death or end in a situation or relationship, you know, playing with you, just keep you on the back burner. And when they get through showing up, because this is a person who think they all bad. This is a person who has a lot going on for themselves, and they like that lifestyle, and they don't want to give it up because they praise. They're the big man, a big woman in this position. This could be whoever. And you may not be where you want to be yet, but they know you got potential. So they want to keep, or you might be where you at. You might be just as big as they are, but they want to outshine you, you know, and keep you only when they need you for that little role. It's like, it's like the church girl and the whore, you know, separating the two. They don't understand both of them goes together, light and the dark. But they don't want you to be that way. They they can't stand you see, seeing you messing around with somebody else. So what they want to keep you in that box of they that what they put you in on a pedestal, knowing that everybody human and everybody go through shit, and everybody makes mistakes and everybody learn from the mistakes. You know, yeah, that's the type of person. Yeah, just want you in your head dreaming about them. Don't focus on what I'm doing. Um, stay caring about me. Uh, wait till I call you. Um, you know, wait till I come around for you do something. Making decisions for you. Going back to the caveman or the uh, slavery days. You, ask me. you know what I'm saying? It's like, what world this person is in for real? You know, it's like... Putting somebody, other people above you, you're going to be always last. But they don't want you to go nowhere. They don't want you to have a life. I remember I was I mentioned before about a lady. She waited 14 years for somebody that was married. And he told her he was going to divorce his wife. And when his wife died, he still didn't marry her. She was older. He was older. I was driving cabs then. You know? Uh, Queen of Swords. Cold, hard, demanding authority. See, you want the truth, but they trying to have power over you. It's fine. Doing all the same old story. Different day. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They don't want you to have no plans, no future. You know, they really want they really want you to be under them so they can give you crumbs. Could care less about how you living. What's going on in your life? Don't, you know, don't try to get higher. Don't try to rise up to the occasion. Security help in hand. But you have this always on your side. That's what they keep forgetting. Everybody has a mission and a path. And everybody has things that they want to do. But they want to keep you low key. Visitor message to share. Here they come with their little pinnacle. You know. Uh, giving you some excuses just so they can get what they want, do what they want to do, ruin your life, go off into the sunset and live their lavish way. But they don't want to look back and see you trying to get up. The minute they see you trying to get up, here they come to squash you back down if you let them. Okay, 
this is what I'm getting from this. Yeah. They don't want you happy. They don't want you enjoying. They don't want you dating. They don't want you, uh, they, they don't like you being happy. Period. They don't like that. Only when they with you. No dreaming. You know. Happy house, childhood memories. Want you always in your head, always feeling down, always thinking about what could have happened. It might be somebody you've been known for a long time. You know. Um, and they probably got a lot of childhood issues. They probably seen dad do this to mom. You know, and they figured it's the way it go. Or mom do this to dad. You know, you spiritual. And uh, have your plans, but see plans reversed. They don't want you to have any plans. The same old story. Yeah, they want to control you. Yeah. Same old story. But how you going to com control the emperor? Same old thing. This same old thing we go through, Libra. Same old shit. You going to have what you want to have and go where you need to go. You play the game better than they do. And then if, if a situation, you probably want to start a damn game with them and was being honest with them, but they didn't like that. They didn't like you being that. They didn't, they weren't going to have you, uh, you know, be the upper hand, and you wasn't even trying. You was being honest. I just wanted some play, you know. I was, you was being honest. They didn't like that. Playing their game. But you wasn't even playing the game. Frustration, feeling bound and gay. You will not feel, you will not be this way. Period. Trying to stop your worldly desires and what you want to do. And how can you stop an emperor stuff? You can't do that. You're going to get hurt. Trying to offer you some shit. And you don't want that. That's like a, a dig to me. Like, I don't want that shit. That's okay. I don't care if you got big dick or whatever. I could uh, roll with the little ones. I ain't got to worry about a dick size. I'm worried about who is open and honest with me. You know, because I ain't worried about none of that kind of stuff. And I, you know. So uh, open and honest and fair and consistent and trustworthy. You know what I'm saying? On the same page. I don't give a fuck about no having a big. I remember this young girl. <laughs> so funny. I'm sorry. This young girl thought she was going to play this older man. And that's another thing you're mad about. You're probably older than them. And they were surprised that you wasn't worldwide, right? And good. And she was trying to play this older man. Man, if I tell y'all this man, uh, penis was horse size. That young girl didn't know what to do. I'm pretty sure she ruined for everybody else. She followed that man around like a dummy after that. And he got a nerd trying to talk to me. But take that horse shit. <laughs> take that shit over there. Because I don't want it. So be careful who you try to fuck around with. <clears throat> and fuck over. And think you're going to have them. You gonna have, they going to have your ass. Probably why they're doing it now. They're running behind you because it wasn't what they thought. Temperance reverse. Yeah, they don't want you going on your path. They don't want you secure. You already know it was a test. They don't want you grounded. They don't want to give no equal, equal, uh, equal give and take. They don't want you to think nobody care. You know, uh, probably doing all kind of curses and trying to stop your money flow. They trying to do, you know, all kind of stuff. But it's going to blow up in their face, period. Yeah, because you got your guard up. You're like, I don't know, do your best. Okay, seven of wands. Third Deacon Leo, if it cut off, that means it's all the messages are supposed to be seen. Frustration, you are able to overcome your frustrations. You're on top of the situation. Yeah, you already know that shit. Okay, go and do your best. Because I already know the best ones have tried to fuck with me through the years. And I hate to say I had to bear it. I mean, I didn't have to bear them, but the creators buried them. Our creators made them down where they didn't want to be. Okay. Ain't nobody trying to one-up you. You ain't got time. You already recognize they're trying to be better than you. Trying to oh, man, 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 the time of that shit. Okay. Then we got uh, cold, abusive, demanding respect. You squash that shit. All that. But I already know what you're doing. Yeah, go judge. Try 
that might make it like they don't want you to have justice. You, you know, they don't want you to have nothing. Same old shit, different day. That's why I'm so cautious of who coming to my life. Because I could tell if you know who you are. And you're secure within yourself. Time for no BS. You going on your path, Libra. You, you doing what you need to do. You strong. Got good looks. You gotta recognize the cleverness and the, all the shit. Because you, you already know them gang. The snakes. The feminine energy. They don't know about you being that. As well, slithering your way on out of that shit. Trying to come in, yeah, you getting up out of that. Bye, boo. Stay in your profession, stay in focus. You already know they're wet and sneaky and all that kind of shit. No, uh, uh, squad, you blew up that mountain, really. That's really what it is, them obstacles. Okay. Like I said, they might bury themselves. Trying to change you. Or hang you on the cross. And hang themselves. You loyal. You ain't worried about shit, okay? You know how to make things grow from the bottom to the top. They trying to stop your growth, but that ain't gonna happen. You staying grounded, enjoying yourself, mingling, talking to people when you feel like it. You know what I'm saying? They trying to break your heart. You ain't in love with them anyway. I mean, it takes a lot for a Libra to be in love. You know, we infatuated and, and you know, and care and stuff like that, but to give you our whole hearts, because we real share with that type of people, but for me, just give you my whole heart, you got to earn it. Too sneaky, got too many secrets, okay? Tower, came down, change. All this finna stop. I don't care if you kind of text or come over or call or keep trying to find and interrupt and we secure, okay? Book closed, baby. So stop being childish and stupid. Stop trying to punish people, okay? Because you know you're unloyal. You're a dog. A time, big dog. That's who you are. But we going to shine, boo-boo. Thank you. Hey. Don't even know how to be a player. If you was a pimp, you don't even know how to be a pimp. Pimps in my days took care of their hoes. Educating them every damn thing. And when they decide to move on, they recruited more. And people don't know nothing about that. The loyalty. Loyalty among crooks. Yeah. Yeah. Even dessert. Pulling out too many. Look at this. Wanted to come out. Trying to pretend like they ain't gay or they ain't uh, evil or mean or crazy or something like that. You see right through there. You do anything. A dog or a fuck any damn thing. Okay. I got time for the sheet. Scorpio again. Four. Realization, boom. You realize you can't do nothing with the Libra, right? That nothing can resist the firm will which has for a lover the knowledge of the true and just to combat in order to secure its realization is more than right, it is a duty. The man who triumphs in the death struggle only accomplishes his earthly mission. He who succumbs and devoted himself to it gains immortality. So you must don't want immortality. We do. Oh, shit. They got Jack Sagittarius reverse. I respect Sagittarius. I'm a Sag, half Sag myself, but you know, uh, you gotta check people's choice. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You gotta know who you're dealing with. You know? Uh, scepter signifies ruled by Sagittarius, bolivian, free, jovial, quick tempered, energetic, fond of outdoor sports. You thought you was playing chess and checkers. I see you. Shit. I'm a one. One is the loneliest. No, it's not. You ain't lonely. Shit, you trying to figure out shit going on. You enjoy your own company. We got Jack of Coins. Aquarius. Witty. Argumentative. 
admirable, artistic, humanitarian, fond of refined society. I know. Reverse. You thought you knew him, but you don't. Okay. And then number 19, Leo. Reverse. I mean, this could be a whole bunch of people leaving. The sun, they don't want they don't want you to shine. Well, I tell you, happiness, joy, they don't want you to be happy and joyful. That the light of the mysteries is a redoubtable fluid put by nature at the service of the will. She lights those who know how to direct her. She strikes down with a thunderbolt those who ignore her power or who abuse it. You know, if you're in a relationship and you don't feel secure and you you know it's important for us to feel that way and in a relationship and you don't even want to marry the person but you're still thinking about it if you got to think about it then that's not the relationship you should be in empress or emperor think about that that's not for you evacuation rebuke okay see we like peace you're not in, in that, and it's, and you drown in that place where dead on the operating table set up. What they trying to do to you? Be careful of robbing funeral home companies' body parts. I don't know what that means. It means something to somebody. But I'm like, you know, it. I mean, what's the, what they there for? I don't, I don't understand. If you uncomfortable and don't want to marry the person, you got doubts. Evidently, there's something you need to address, okay? Something you're uncomfortable about. Why would you want to continue a relationship just to see or just to say you got a man or a woman and you don't even trust that person and you study trying to do things to get their attention? What you doing that to yourself for? Return to sender, address unknown. Write books, novels, movies. Focus on what you're supposed to be doing and, and wait for the person. Or be happy with yourself if you, if it's not meant for you to have somebody. Just enjoy life. I mean, I want to make enough money. If I want to call somebody and pay them a good service. That's my prerogative. It's my prerogative. The fuck I want to do. Somebody comes along, that's fine. They can't nobody be, I don't want nobody worry me. Buried alive, alive at funeral homes. See, that's twice. About funerals, my condolences, but they somebody might be trying to bury you. Are you messing with uh, what's the death card? Granddaughter, truancy, another cultured child, breaking curfew. Making drugs. So I don't know, just be careful, leave a gang gang. You know? Unemployed. Might be jealous of you. And you feel it and you know it. But you wanna put think you're gonna play the game with somebody in your household or around you and you know this person ain't right. Why do that to yourself? For who? Who you showing off to? This your life you playing with. You're secure. Heal, soul. Rest your mind. Free your mind. Meditate. Snowflake. Laugh. Love unconditional and yourself. Be humble. And you know what I mean by that. That ain't weak. You understanding what's going on. Caring about yourself. You caring about other people, but I can't have you in my space. A smile is contagious. Okay. Go deep. Peace and mind. Live and let live. You're a diamond. You're a diamond. So wear them. I mean, why put yourself just to say you got somebody when you know it ain't right? Some leavers love their money, though. They'll keep them there because they're paying the bills. Whatever. And uh, myself is, I just, I'm going to divorce. I just, uh, don't want, I haven't found nobody that I really care about. Let's get a divorce. 
seventh chakra, our number crown chakra, spiritual awakeness. When my mind sways negatively, I remind myself of love, truth, gratitude, and spirit. I am an observer of my thoughts, and I do not let them bring me down. I remind myself to have gratitude and acceptance for what is, and to have the courage of my convictions. I continue to pursue a clear, clearer understand the spiritual truth behind all that is and all that is unfolding. I ask myself, is what I'm thinking the truth? And is it having a positive or negative impact in my life? Love y'all. Uh, like, subscribe, share, and comment. I really appreciate it. And I think that's fitting. What are you doing? If you notice what the person doing, who want to play with this? You've not been through that. You should be older and wiser now. Not going back. They want you to go back to childhood. They want you to go back to some dumb shit that you didn't already graduated from. Don't do that to yourself. This is a big old world. We need to explore that bad boy. That's what I want to do. I right, love y'all. Bye.